What's good, man? This your boy Sam Foley, the GOAT. And right now you're rocking with 231 TV. And now we're right here with the showstopper, Mr. Inside Outside himself, LIB King, LIB Music, LIB Pop. What's up, big time? Don't jet, man. We're here live, 231 TV. Yes, sir. Yeah, my bro, Shadow Man. Shadow Don't Man jet. of Venom. What's good? What's well, going on? <laughs> Bad, man. Yeah, man. <laughs> and you already know, man. It's the first annual. Uh, Afro Music Fest, and you know, Big Tom had to come out there and represent for the LIB community. So, how was that, man? How did it feel for you to open up for like guys like Awilo and IOJ, people who like start off the whole like African music scene? Well, for me, I would say Awilo is the godfather, you know what I mean, when it comes to you know, Avira music, you know what I mean, salute. But just want to say, all the other artists, you know what I mean, they are great, they are good, you know, but. We all doing our thing, mm -hmm. representing LRB. We gotta keep moving the flag, man. You know what I mean? This for my country, LRB. It's for Africa. It's for the world. Sure. You know, it's, uh, it's African music, so you know, just gotta represent. Yeah, man. You know, you representing me. You killing the stage, man. Don't you check. know, you know, Inside Outside is a big hit in the LRB community. They're still playing that song everywhere to go in LRB right now. What's, what you been working on? How, like, you know, what I'm saying, what you been doing? Well. I've been working. everybody want to know about that. I've been working and I've been cooking. I just got a new song out, you know. Right now it's been playing everywhere. S O S O, you know, you know, back home now, you know, like yeah. you know, coming up. You know. I heard about S O S O, like it was hot. Yeah, it's, yeah. it's still hot right now. It was playing at the club and yeah, stuff like yeah, that. Yeah, How know. did you come up with that song? Man, I was just trying to be creative. You know? mm -hmm. Just trying to do something different. My people told, you know, I mean. Take them way back in the days, you yeah. know. But yeah, you know, it's something creative that I came out with, you know. Yeah. And I believe the audience love it, you know. Even some of my East African you know, audience too, you know, they love it, you know. They play everywhere, you know. And it's a blessing, you know, to see the music traveling all around. Mm -hmm. You know, and also to working with my bro right here, man. It's a blessing too, man, you know. And how did you guys uh, meet? Man. <laughs> <laughs> right now, I can say we're family. Yeah. You know what I mean? Got over everything, but we're family. But like you know, my boy first came to the state. You know, when he came to Minnesota, mm -hmm. and thing they invited me to a studio with D12. Yeah, and D12 is doing his thing. Yeah, shout out D12 and, and, and LIB right and now. You know, I felt the energy. I like man. Yes, sir. Know, we've been working, you know, until you know he came out here, and we just collab together, and you know, right now we're on a one umbrella, yep. and we keep moving forward. So what? How do you like as far as the Liberian music scene? Like the Liberian music scene is doing really good in Africa, you know. Apart from the Nigerian music scene, because Nigerians been started the music scene. The Liberian music scene is coming from nowhere, and right. these got people like CIC, Big Time, Bucky Raw, Kubasi, Christopher the Change. Like all these people is coming up. How proud are you for the Liberian music? How is this like a dream to see like Liberian music come on this kind of stage? Oh hell yeah, it's my dream, man. Because it's like we all been working hard, but to see the level that we have elevated to, you know, mm -hmm. it's it's a blessing to see how how Liberian music are already skyrocket and you know. But everybody, shout out all the artists I'm making here with. Proud of y'all, even though up here too. Making Liberian music go all around Africa and all around the world, mm -hmm. you know, and we will continue to support. You know, it's all about showing, showing each other support. You know what I mean? So, mm -hmm. but yeah, it's all about showing support and showing love to one another. That's what's up, man. You always support everybody, man. Oh, yeah. Every time I've been New York, I've been New York ever since I was a young nigga, like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Ever since I was young, you've been doing this music <laughs> shit, been mixing, mastering, everything. and everything. You work with every artist in Minnesota, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I'm proud to see my man's Big Town on the bigger stage, downtown Minneapolis, at the Skyway, opening up for Awido, like the greatest um, African artist to right. ever do this, you know what I'm saying? So you set in the stage for people, right. and you're giving people that energy, you know what I'm saying? I'm proud of you. And that's a Liberian young boy like me. I love to see my Liberian people out there doing their thing. Man, I'm proud of all of you guys for doing your thing, you know? 